much. Did you guys oh ever God. meet before today? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we uh, somewhere along the way. Yeah. And we talked over Instagram. She was so sweet. She sent me the sweetest DM after a performance. And it just, she's, she's amazing. So and I'm like, never one to try to be the coolest person in the room and play anything close to the vest. I'm like, oh my God, you're I amazing. Know, she's so sweet. And I feel oh. like we're so, I, I don't know, like we've, had similar journeys mm -hmm. and I feel like we've had like a similar like spiritual evolution process yeah. if you will and well, I, why I do you say a that? lot of why, I just watch Leanne and how she connects to people and and kind of like I'm saying it like you're not uh, here I'm not but, la, 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 la. but <laughs> no there's like a a very like zen peaceful quality about Leanne that I think you come to like when you especially when you've been in this business so long and you're yeah. like you know what, I don't want this business to eat me alive. I want yeah. to find that peacefulness and totally. that joy always. And I don't know, I just feel yeah. a connection. I agree. Yeah, totally. She's, she's a doll. <laughs> uh, and, and you started a little later than... Um... I started at 16. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, a couple wow. of years. Wow, you were all waiting yeah, at that point. Yeah. So it's been 36 years. I just I just celebrated the 35th anniversary of the debut album, Out of the oh Blue, gosh, release here crazy. in New York, because it all started here. Right. I'm a native New Yorker, and I was playing the clubs at 16, and that's crazy. Yeah. crazy. That's With my crazy. now late momager Diane, and oh. she was crazy and wild enough to take me around to those clubs to get it all going. How was that play? <laughs> I never played clubs, you know, as a kid. How was that playing clubs as a kid? I mean, we went in the back door, couldn't go in the front door. Like, right. you know, probably if they knew how realized how old I was, they never would have let me play. And it was, you know what, it was the so best funny. training ground because I had to get people's attention. And I'm oh, sure yeah. you did similar, yeah. you know, where you had to really like... You had to work for it. You had to work for it. <laughs> you had, you know, that's where I developed my chops. Yeah. But like, really, that's where I developed how to go with anything. I see anything going wrong on stage as an opportunity. Absolutely. Like, make, crack a joke, have an yeah. experience with the audience. Like, how you get through it is everything. And that's what the club grounds did for me. Yeah. 